Welcome to the Learning Academy. Today our language of choice is Swahili. We will be using Google Translate to help us to pronounce and actually to spell certain phrases in Swahili. Common phrases. So let's start with hello. You press the arrow. And hello in Swahili is abari. Repeat with me. Abari. So abari means hello in Swahili. Let's try another word. And we press the arrow again. The word we're trying to translate is how are you? No, how are you in Swahili is abari yako. Abari yako. Now, how do you respond to how are you or abari yako? You respond, I am fine. And that translates to sijambo. Repeat after me, sijambo. Sijambo. I am fine. So, abari yako. Sijambo. Now, there are other phrases that you'd like to use. Maybe you'd like to say, happy birthday. Now, happy birthday is, Siku ya kujaliwa enjema. Siku ya kujaliwa enjema. That's happy birthday in Swahili. Siku ya Kujaliwa enjema. Now let's try another word that we can translate. Good. Zuri. Good morning. Would be. Abari za ashubui. So good morning in Swahili is. Abari za ashubui. Abari za ashubui. Let's try good evening. Now, these phrases are commonly used in conversations across all languages. It's just how it is said. Now, in order for you to say good evening in Swahili, it is Abari ja jionai. Repeat, Abari ja jionai. So that's good evening in Swahili. Abari ja jionai. Abari ja jionai. That's good evening. What other words could we try? Let's try. We tried good morning. Good evening. Did we do good night? Let's try good night. No, good night is usiku muena. Usiku muena. So, usiku muena, that's good night in Swahili. Other phrases in Swahili that could be used on a daily basis include, Have a good day. Have a good day in Swahili is, Kua nasiku enjema. Kua nasiku enjema, that's have a good day. Now, let's look for another phrase. What about goodbye? We know that hello is abari. Goodbye is kwaheri. Kwaheri. That's goodbye in Swahili. Let's try, please. Please in Swahili is tafadali. Tafadali means Please in Swahili. Let's try another term. Thank you. Thank you in Swahili is asante. Asante means thank you in Swahili. Let's try another word or term. What about your welcome? Your welcome is karibu. 
Taribo means you're welcome in Swahili. Now, another way that person just say welcome is they just say welcome and it's Karibu as well. So, Karibu means welcome and you're welcome in Swahili. So, please, please, let's review, please. Tafadali. Then, there is thank you. Asante, there is also hello, Abari, there is also goodbye, goodbye, is Kwaeri, so hello, Abari, goodbye, Kwaeri, have a good day. Have a good day now is Kwa Nasiku Njema. Kwa Nasiku Njema. That's have a good day. There is also I am sorry. I am sorry in Swahili is Samaani. Samaani means I am sorry. Samaani, I am sorry. What other phrases could we look at? Happy birthday. No, happy birthday is Siku ya kujaliwa enjema. Siku ya kujaliwa enjema. That is happy birthday in Swahili. Now, I have been fortunate well all of us have been fortunate to be able to explore various languages through google translate so learning has been placed in our hands learning foreign languages has now become way more easier because of google translate the opportunities exist for learning to be explored in every way it's just for us to explore it with the opportunities that we have been provided and with the resources that we have been given. So let's try a full phrase. Good morning. How are you? This is something we would normally text. So it would be Asubui Njema Vipi Wewe. Right? It is very different from when we just had How are you by itself? It was Abari. Yako. Abari Yako. I am fine would be. Let's look at I am fine. Again, I am fine is Shijambo. Shijambo. And if we said thank you, we would be saying Asante. And if we wanted to say you're welcome. It would just be one phrase is Karibu. If we wanted to say goodbye, goodbye, it would be Kwairi. And of course, we know good. Good is Mzuri. Let's try to see what the translation for goddess is. Hmm. Mgu mm wakiki um go wakiki right so let's try I love you that's something we need to say often I love you right nakupenda right nakupenda means I love you in Swahili nakupenda Nakupenda. So now I'm going to say goodbye again, which is actually quite. Remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe. This has been an exploration of a new language, Swahili. And I would love for you to continue learning the language with me. So at some other point, 
we will explore other commonly used phrases in Swahili using Google Translate. And hopefully, one day we'll be able to go to South Africa to experience the culture for ourselves and also delve into the language of Swahili. Like, comment, share and subscribe. Leave your comments down below and let me know what you think about this language, Swahili.